going to shout those two cars. Now I've seen I, both I, of them. I got it figured out. I know what yep. you're doing now. The Beano one looks bad, but the chassis one looks horrible. It looks worse. Yes. So the chassis one over at uh, Weaver thing. So many things wrong with it. Oh, it's just not even funny. Yeah. And you can let tell. me let me count the ways. I ran out of fingers. Yes. I ran out of toes. And you can tell the people who have seen chassis system versus the ones who haven't. Oh, I like it. That's a good chassis system engine. No, it ain't. No, it sucks. It sucks. Take that engine, put it next to, put it next to a GP50 or GP40-2. Oh yeah. Put it next to or GP9. Take it up to the museum and stick it next to the GP38. Yeah. There. Let me know what you think. Well, now, I will say this, okay, in comparison, the Seaboard, so far, is the best one. Yeah. But that doesn't say much at all. No, it ain't saying much. Well, how, how, can you, how can you screw up gray paint? By putting blue paint on it. Oh, yeah, so that's what, he's got a couple up. Modification may be, you know, couple down to those cars and just stick them in the middle. Stick them in the middle. Because he still may go down to the other and switch the to watch. Make sure it's a foul switch. Right, yeah. Like with these, some of these guys that you know, it, it, it likes those trailers here. Which, and I said to one guy, which are your favorite railroad gets treated like that? And say how much yeah. you like it. Let me know how you like it when they do. Well, how the hell can you talk about it? It's black. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you paint it yellow and put Union Pacific on the side of it. Yeah. The Conrail one's gonna look bad. Yeah. Now, there's rumors out that they're going to do the Western Maryland one in uh, red, white, and black. Oh, okay, God, don't fuck that up to no end. Yep. They will fuck that up to no end. I'm waiting for them. Then they're going to screw up the they're going to screw the CNO up. Yeah. They're going to screw the uh, airline up. Yep. They're going to screw. Gonna, yeah. I can't see anyone that they're going to come out any way decent. No. Nah. Ain't no one coming out. I mean, if they wanted to show fading the CSX to the Harris, they should have just painted the entire sides. They just left the nose and the front of the cab in the CSX. Yeah. 
It would have been better. Than actually, what, if you get, if you look at the nose, it actually is a fallback to yellow nose too. Yes. Well, see, as I said, we're not Norfolk Southern, and we're not doing what they did. They proved it. Oh yeah, you know, Norfolk Southern did it right. <laughs> yeah. Even the ones that they even screwed up, at least it's better what CSX is doing. Yeah, but they went back and fixed it. True, true. You know, they screwed the Lehigh Valley of it, but then they went back and fixed it in less than a week. Yeah, I think the Pensy they fixed. They fi fixed the Pensy too. Wabash is based off of the uh, bluebirds or the cannonballs. Yeah. Erie's uh, right, Conrail's right. Oh hell, they still have guys still had guys at Judy Anderson. They but, still had the uh, blue in the in the lockers. They still had blue in their lockers. <laughs> yeah, I had all well, I don't know if you yeah, you haven't probably hadn't heard. Uh, about two months ago my house caught fire. No, I didn't know about that. Burnt everything. Right. I managed to save maybe about 75% of the trains, but I still got to go through and see what's good. Right. Uh, my computer, with all my videos I hadn't posted to YouTube yet, about a year's worth are gone. Uh, I just got to go through and check. I got slides out, but I need to go through those and see what actually didn't get damaged from the heat. But... Have you called a... Uh Oh yeah, I'm restoration company for the slides and pictures. I uh, not yet. Well, it's probably too late now. Well, I mean the box, the room I had in my bedroom got more just smoke and uh, damage than anything else. Smoke damage, no water damage. No, it doesn't look like much water damage. So they should be okay. Um. But, but, all, but all your models got water damage. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. I was doing a storage shed right now, just drying out until I get something settled. I'm waiting for the mortgage company to send me back the insurance check after they take out what I still owe on the mortgage. Then looking to get something, a new house someplace. Because I'm not going to rebuild that one. Where was your house at? On Walkins Avenue in the city. The oh, Baltimore. okay. You want to stay in the city or I'm I'm looking at Lansdowne, St. Dennis, some place in like Jack Dent Grand area. But definitely getting out of the city. I see I saw the Brooklyn Hill gang was out of the city. Yeah. Uh St. Dennis kinda well, I don't know. The new generation of uh, hyperactive kids are down there, and some days they are just absolutely wrong. Well, then why do you take me allowed? You're not. You're. You're not that bad. <laughs> but you do. Okay. Who's worse, you or Wesley? I was joking. I know. That picked up those cars. Yeah, he came back and grabbed those too. He's switching ends, so he's going to be the. Yeah, tell him about Wesley James. No, it was kid Wesley, what's it, about 12? Hyperactive is unbelievable. He's been told by everybody to shut the fuck up numerous times. All the way down. I guess maybe.
he's still going. He's going to back those guys in on the west end of that track down there. That's what he's going to do. Well, he's got way too many corner claws inside of him. special train just to get this shit cleaned out because there ain't no way they can come up here with their next pickup. Yeah. He's, got he's going he's going back him into the side and down off the west end. Those there. He's leaving those there, leaving those there. Now we're going to make the track inspector come up here. Count how many cars he's got for <laughs> Train together at Lincoln. I chased him out to uh, Smith Station. There was nothing at Smith Station for him to pick up. Yeah. He, I mean, he backed this stuff in and went through the siding. Back to York he went. After he did that, I came up here. What time do they usually start putting a uh, train together in the Seven o'clock Well, it all depends. Usually it's a seven o'clock call at Lincoln. Okay. You know, but they're running up the GP15 now. Well, I haven't been up to chase anything up on your. I've tried, I've thought about it a couple of times, but something else always popped up. They got fucked. They got five GP15s. Oh, the the uh, the X South Carolina Central GP10, the uh, 1500, and one of the other GP16s. They're all down at the old. Uh, they're at the west end of the yard. And dead. Okay. I don't know where they got the other GP16 sitting at. They got, they've all been condemned. What happened to them? Rushed it out finally? No, yeah, it's part of that GP8 set. Oh, yeah, okay. It's like these guys lost a couple of West Yeah. I read the other day where they just, James in Wyoming just signed a contract with uh, Web Tech to get 80. Or 90 dash nines, yes, yeah, something like that. Yeah, oh my god, the fucking things are like, like the fucking plague. It's that fucking. Well, I guess it could be worse. They could be picking up jeevers. As they say, you pick yeah. the poison. Dash nines are jubos. What's Gilligan's name again? Edwin. Edward. Edwin. Edwin, huh? Yeah. Gilligan works better. Uh. 
Yeah. He's getting bored. Oh, boo hoo. Go upload a video. Winterfest for EBT. It actually wasn't that cold up there, surprisingly. Last year wasn't cold at all. Not overall. I didn't even I didn't even plow my driveway once. I put the plow on Thanksgiving weekend, took it off. Then why April first. I actually went out there a couple days just to uh, start the Start it up to make sure it's still ran. Chased the Gettysburg not too long ago. They got a new engine. Yeah, I haven't gotten up for that one yet. The last time I got him. Which one? Uh, I got him when they had they were running the 1000 and 1001. They got a new 38. That's I've seen some stuff about it. From what I've what I've seen of it, and research I've done on it's an ex copper base or Phelps Dodge Mining, Alab, Arizona. Ooh, it's got a, got an extra heavy duty air conditioner on the roof. I was just going to say that. Yep, it's got a uh, on the uh, it's got extra uh, coil. Pulling coils behind the fuel tank, but before the rear truck. Well, I might try to put that on the list of things to do after uh, September. That's up there at uh, Gardner's. Old wow. Krause food. Yeah, that, that actually looks pretty good. I went up there that day expecting 1,000, 1,001. Last time I was up there, I pulled into the yard and was asked, not sternly but nicely, to leave. Yeah. That's up at Gardner's. I chased them all day long. I got them. I, I didn't catch Biglerville at 10 o'clock is when they finally made it to Biglerville. Damn. Him and I chased it back in the fall of last year. Chased it all the way out to the interchange. So did I. Then we got word on Facebook that there were four heritages going to come through uh, Cove within like two hours. So I was like, okay, we'll go up there. Wait for a long day. Oh, yes it did. Cause it was, it was after one. It was, at, it was almost two o'clock by the time he got done at Holly Springs. I think we had to chase him back a little ways and then he cut off the chain. It was five o'clock and he still had Dr. Pepper to work at Asper's. He still had his pickup to make it Biglerville before he got back to the yard. Damn. OT for that crew. Now, when I was talking to the conductor, I was about to ask him what time he was good to. And he was starting to, starting to move back. Thank 
25 and 35, that's 80. Yeah. That's 80 cars, that's nothing. We just send up, just send a crew up, pick them up, clean. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I was, one time we saw a pair that three, CSX sent three SD40-2 down. Last time I called them up here, CSX had two crack nines up here. So at one point, I got a picture somewhere, well, I had a picture somewhere, of Mel Millen's four SD40-2s and CSX's three SD40-2s all within, right along the road up here, real far. It's like, okay, that's a pretty cool looking shot. Where are you working at nowadays? You still with that door company? Nah, I uh, got fired from there. From I got set up. Well, not set up. But I dropped a pallet of doors, and the supervisor, he was told within two minutes of it happening by the other guy, the uh, shop crew. But of course, I didn't say anything within a few minutes. They fired me because of it. I'm going to get a place down in Crofton called uh, Old Castle APG. They make um, pavers and retaining walls uh, and cinder blocks. Man, Wilkins to Crofton, that sucks. That's a hell of a fucking ruin. It was, yeah. There ain't no easy way to get there either. The uh, only way is basically the beltway to 97 to 3. Like yep. It's, I mean, you go to the back way 170, but it's not any better. No. No way. Well, actually, after the fire, uh, the insurance company moved me into an apartment over by in Lithicum Heights, so I'm, I cut the distance in half. Right. But it still ain't no easy way. I still got to deal with the boat weighing 97 every day. Shit, I started fucking renovation Wednesday. A fucking Gibson Island. Damn. That's two hours from my fucking house. I was gonna say you saw up and uh, yeah. Damn. That's two hours from my fucking house. Half half the fucking day is why I get dropped back. I'm only working four days a week. Yeah. I'm only working ten hours working ten hours a day. But I'm getting paid two hours drive time. I don't give it. Well, I don't Start working till eight any fucking way. Yeah. You got to be out of there by five. I know when I was with the door company, one of, about I don't know eight nine years ago, they were built a couple of uh, on the one they were doing the clubhouse, replacing all the doors and stuff, and the house was being built. So yeah, on the bill lady, no entry before eight a.m. Must, ed, must exit by, he said five o'clock, but I was out waiting for it, so. Yeah. And my boss couldn't understand why he had to put it so far in the middle of the day. Why can't I go there first? Because you're not allowed to be there to after eight o'clock. You can't get on, you can't, no. I told him one day, oh, you can send me there at six o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna I'll sit. be sitting on the parking lot for two hours, asleep. That's just nobody jumps the line in front of you. Yeah. Same thing with some deliveries I had in D.C. Couldn't be there after 9 o'clock, and they want me the first thing in the morning at 5 o'clock. Okay, I'll go find some place to sleep for a couple hours. I'm guessing they're going to run 18 as the lead unit down. Oh. He's, he's coming back in through the fucking side. I'll take that, because I want the other SC-50. Excuse me, class, but you're being an ass. Excuse me, class. What the fuck, Chuck? I was asking you, you failed condom. You perfect excuse for condom salesman.